Tuesday. Taco Tuesday today. Ooh. Y'all, I noticed that when I come to you all, I always have on some red or some pink. Um, maybe a little bit of white. But I just always have red or pink on. I just, I just know that to be the truth. I'm gonna take a different route today. Maybe it'll make me feel better or feel a little different. This morning I woke up um, with raw emotion. Just I, I woke, I woke up feeling really raw. I woke up feeling very vulnerable, very uh, exposed. so forth um this is this is not my first time feeling like this um so it, it's a it's a feeling it's a feeling that i'm familiar with it's a feeling i'm familiar with um so i'm, I'm not i'm not like <gasps> oh the precious you know I'm, I'm not like that but what i will say is i've got to figure out Not so much what caused it, what causes the raw feeling, but why, and why it sticks as hard as it, it does. Why does it stick as hard as it does? Um, last night I was having a conversation and the conversation just kind of came out of nowhere. It, it was something so minute something really minute um the conversation was zodiac signs um and since moving moving back to the area to florida um uh, an ongoing thing that i noticed when you meet people is they always ask what's your zodiac sign it's not some something I wasn't familiar with. It was definitely something I'm, I'm not accustomed to. Um, not off initial meetings. It's that that is definitely something I'm not accustomed to. Um, so I, I, it, it used to just baffle me because I'm like. And probably coming from where I'm coming from and the belief that I've been trained, you know, zodiac signs is wizardry or 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 the crafting of the devil or or uh, just wizards, you know, witchcraft and all this kind of carrying on. So I, I, you know, I won't say because I learned that I just never paid any attention to it. But because I learned that, I just never paid any attention to it. <laughs> um, with that being said, the conversation was why is it that we write people off based on their zodiac signs? Oh, you a Taurus or or you a cancer, or you a Capricorn. Oh, I can't, mm -mm. I can't mess, I, I, I can't mess with you. I can't mess with you, I can't talk to you, I can't deal with you. And when I would hear that in my mind, like, you don't, you, you, you don't know me. You don't know me, you don't know me. And I'm not saying you don't know me like it was preference to me, but in my mind when I overhear these things or when I hear people talk or ask or, or make the remark, ooh, uh, uh, 
Y'all know me. You, what? So we not all right based on my horoscope sign or my zodiac, not my horoscope sign, my zodiac sign. I said, okay. Okay. So rather than to do some compar comparables based on the zodiac sign themselves, I, I started doing comparables just based on the elements. Earth, wind, water, fire. Now, I'm a water sign. I'm a water sign. And then I'm a cancer. And so when I went to just look at the basic overall view of cancers, I'm like, I don't, I don't fit the bill. I don't fit the bill you know they were they were um, they can be introverted they're introverts there are moments when I'm introverted but for the most part I can play in both spaces I can play in both spaces um, which one I prefer there's no preference either I can play in both spaces I don't mind sitting alone I was the only child for 11 years so I don't mind being by myself. I know how to move by myself, but I don't mind being amongst people as well. I, I, I know how to be a shining light in a crowd of people. I, I know how to do that. Um, I mean, then it went on to say that it, it really, the, the adjectives that it provided was very emotional based, very emotional based. Um, and perhaps maybe in my younger years, I was e emotionally, really emotionally based. Whereas now I'm, I'm more logically driven, like make it make sense. Um, just because I won't move off of my emotions. We, as people, we're, we're very fickle. We're very fickle. Um, we, we just kind of move as the wind go blows. We, we go as the wind goes. Um, for me, when I'm feeling something, I try to sit in it and not make not make a decision based on that e initial reaction. Um, I don't know. But some, a part of me appreciates a person who can feel, I won't say necessarily be, um, 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 what's the word, um, impulsive, but feel something, recognize what they're feeling, and make an action, create an action about it. I'm, 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 I, I, I admire that, a person who has an opinion about something, um, an, an original thought about something. Anyway, before I get off track, but so from the elements as a as a water sign, and then on top of that as a as a crab, I'm just gonna go ahead and put it out there like that. I can survive in the water, in the deepest of of depths, the ocean floors, but then I can also survive on land I can so with so because I'm on land I think of earth signs so you have your Capricorns your I believe a, a Taurus um a Virgo um and that's just to think of some I'm sure I'm missing somebody and then you have the air signs which is your your Gemini, your Aquarius, and I believe a Libra. Those are the air signs. So I'm like, element-wise, I can play anywhere. Now, fire signs, this can work one of two ways. I can either just put you out or, or I can douse you and we just allow it to steam. Water, 
water holds so it, it's very powerful but so is fire but you can put out fire you can't put water out. you you there, there, water has to cease on its own there, there's nothing to stop a raging sea ain't, ain't, ain't no unless once it hits land when the water hits land then it, it begins to subside I, I, I guess here I am going into science right now but hopefully you get my drift um y'all help me out maybe I need to do some more study or research as it was brought to my attention as it relates to zodiac signs and it, I mean it goes so in depth to and I may be so ignorant to this and I'm okay with that um it, it goes into depth of you was born the first half of the month or the second half of the month or in the beginning of the month or you or or you on the cusp of the month so 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 you can essentially be a Sagittarius Scorpio born at 1159 before going into the next day so so you you have traits of this and then the other so what if you coming out down the birth canal at 11 59 and your head is out but your body is still in i'm being facetious y'all don't you know i'm being comical when i make that point but the point is somebody help me understand how how and why do we write people off based off their zodiac signs how do we do that what am i missing because the the the, the few that i've experienced i i wouldn't write them off it'll just be like i know what to place you in my life not so much that i wouldn't want to deal that i wouldn't want to deal with you I just know where to put you. I, I know based on interaction, personality types, I, I know where to place you. So perhaps my saying that and then someone being like, I can't deal with you, maybe that's the same difference. But I mean, I'm opening it up for discussion. I want somebody to tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. Y'all, I, I, I like to post my original thoughts um, because there there might be someone who may be thinking on the same wavelength as me but just may not be willing to say it but then again I could be the only the only <laughs> person I could be the only person thinking this and hey and I'm I'm with the fugazi you know here I, you know. Ooh, ooh, girl. You know. Here I am with the Fugazi, you know. Trying to figure out what 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 it really is. Y'all, my car is so dirty. I am so embarrassed to even drive it right now because of the pollen. And it's like, why go wash it when it's gonna it's gonna be dirty again within the next couple of days? I, I can't sway, but I like you know I like white cars. I I, I just like white cars. And, and of course, they would be the ones that attract the most dust, you know. So. But y'all, somebody, you know, talk to me. Send me something. Send me some some links to go and read and, and do further research about this whole thing because I want to know what this is. I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. Like when I meet people, that be the first thing they ask. No, the second. What's your name? What's your sign? Isn't that a lyric from a song? 
I think those are some lyrics. I believe those are some lyrics. Mm, I don't hear you. So, that was my rant. Are we, are we, are we writing people off based on them being born? Are we writing them off? Not necessarily in relationship status, but just status in general. Like, oh girl, you a Libra. Mm -mm -mm. You a liar. You know what I mean? Or, or like, let you not deal with me just because you don't deal with 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 me based off what I've shown you. Um, don't prejudge, I guess, because you may you may meet a Libra, a, a Capricorn, a Cancer, or a Scorpio. You may you you may meet them in a different stage in your life. So perhaps they're vibrating at a at a so that's not to say the characteristics aren't the same. Oh, and not to mention, this thing goes all the way into the moon and the stars and the rising stars and and uh, uh, what's your moon sign? What's your rising sign? All of that, y'all. All of that. So my point is, y'all. Somebody send me some information. Send me a link. A credible link credible info you know I don't want the first Google link I don't want that <laughs> but um it, it it basically the conversation needed to be stopped at the end of the day um, because it, 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 it was gonna turn into something bigger than what I initially thought, you know, just a basic talk would have been just out of nowhere. And I think what kept, what what prompted the conversation is I was looking at a book that had several different symbols in them, and so um, you have the the different horoscopes and zodiac signs, and then it, it has all uh, the meaning of certain flowers and stuff like that. So. Um, just different signs, spiritual signs, here and there, symbols, numerology. And um, it, it just prompted me to ask. It just prompted me to ask. So that is it. I've talked for about 19 minutes, you know, so I, I hopefully I got my point across. Um, well, I'm at the office. So y'all, you know, let me know what's up. <clears throat> let me know what it is. Um, so, if you cannot be good, be good at it. Passion, poise, power. <laughs>